It's been a while since I've done a video on GeoGebra, but I had one of my listeners ask, you know, what, uh, how can I create stacked box plots? Because I did this way back <laughs> many, many years ago and had no clue that the video even <laughs> still existed, but evidently it does. And they asked, you know, what, you know, how do we create those now in GeoGebra now that it's evolved? And it's really evolved into a just a beautiful resource for pretty much anybody, anything. It's it's great. So um, geogebra.org um, is where you go. And uh, you can sign in. You don't have to. But uh, we'll just do a stacked box plot and just show you how to do that. And so you've got all these options. You got geometry, 3D graphing, you know, all these on the bottom of this. Uh, so I'm going to just pull up the spreadsheet because that's how you can create box, uh, stacked box plots. So just, you know, of course, my internet's going to run slow as molasses right now. And it brings up um, a graph. You know, here's your calculator and I can make it all fit. But I think what we need to show you is just the spreadsheet now. And then these are your options. And uh, you've got this multivariable analysis tool. And so what I'll do is uh, just simulate three sets of data. So I'm just going to make some numbers up. Two, three, three, four, four, five, five. Let's see. It's not loading. Hold on. There we go. Three, three. Four, four, five, five, six, six. And maybe we want to go seven, 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 eight, 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 nine, nine. And maybe um, I'll just we'll just go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I just made up three sets of data. We'll go ahead and select all three. And, I, and I'm just highlighting the ABC part. And I'm going to go to this multivariable analysis. And automatically it makes uh, a stacked box plot for us uh, with, whoops, with the, uh, you know, with the number line. So there you go. And so there's your stacked box plot. And it shows you the data. You know, there's your, uh, I didn't end up with any uh, outliers. But, it, you know, it's kind of nice. So you can go ahead and, and analyze all three, print them. I mean, there's just a host of things you can do with this. This, you know, shows statistics. So you go to the bottom and you can see all the stats for this thing. Um N is the, we had nine numbers, the mean of each set, standard deviation, if it was a sample, the standard deviation, the five number summary, all that's down here on the bottom. Um, and it's just, it's just brilliant. It's brilliant. They've really created a tool that's very easy to use. And, uh, and that's where I'll end this video because there's a lot more you can explore, but, uh, uh, that's a pretty easy stacked box plot, and you could do more columns if you wanted to, and print it, and do all sorts of fun things. So I hope this helps. See you next time.